Hi guys, I'm Peter Andre, I'm 47 years old and I feel great, I really do. But as the years go on, I'm looking for ways to turn back the time in aging. Now, one capful a day of reverse life marine collagen really does make a difference. I'm on my fifth day. I've got friends that have been taking this for three to four weeks and have noticed incredible differences. One capful a day will make you feel healthier and look younger and will make a huge difference to your hair, nails and skin. We're back, but this time they've given us the cameras. Ooh, bad move. Welcome to Life with the Andres. Come on, Theo, let's go and have you ready, bro. Sit down and eat your food. Come on. Good boy. That's a little bit funny. Well, what do you want? Not so funny. We haven't got a colony, you know. So what, you've got to do live live Zoom lessons? Daddy. Yeah. I've got French now. French? Daddy. Oh, Jean Paul. See, mummy's at work, so when mummy's at work, dad's got to dad's got to step in. That's got to go hard. It's such a different day when Ems is not here. Yeah. Because <laughs> I have to, I'm, I'm to live more lenient. Millie, you're still in your PJs. You know mum loves you getting changed in the morning, yeah, but yeah, you're but... on my watch now, so let's just chill. Theo. Daddy. Theo, how do you feel about being a baby? Daddy. Yeah. I just cut my leg. Hey, um, what do you want for your birthday? If you Puppy. Could... Oh. What else do you want for your birthday? Puppy. You know, the relationship with Princess is fantastic. She is such a good girl. She's very kind. Um, she's sweet. She's great with the children. I'm going to be a teenager, guys. She's going to be a teenager soon, 13, and it's stressing me out. It really is stressing me out. Can I ask you but a question? I want to meet up with Dylan. What? But you could come, and his parents will come to you. Hang on, whoa, let's reverse a bit. You want to meet up with Dylan, you just want to throw that on me like that. Yeah, but like, yeah. You're damn right I'm going to go, and so is his yeah, parents. Yeah, his parents are. Right. You guys can talk. We're going to talk, all right. <laughs> <laughs> yes, Theo? You guys are too protective. No, I did not. I want to make sure that she feels she can talk to me about anything. Uh, all the stuff that I thought I'd freak out about, like, you know, her liking boys and stuff like that. Uh, the, the thought of that used to make me freak out, but when it's your own child and you see it more as sort of a very innocent thing, you kind of... You're okay with it. Well, I'm okay with it. Am yeah, I yeah. as strict as I was? Be no, honest. Right. because I'm older. Right. I'm an adult. And I know that you I'm like Dylan, and have I have I really Dad, given... don't say that. You just said it. No, I hear my friend. Oh, your mate, yeah. Have I, I given you grief about... Mate. Have I given you grief about Dylan? Yeah. What no. have I said? I said he's a really nice guy. Thank you. Having a boy that's a teenager has had its moments, I'm not going to lie, but I've never experienced a girl being a teenager and going through all the changes, so I'm pretty stressed out about that. This is a very rare quiet day. I don't know what's going on. Millie's over there. Theo's here. Bistro and Junior doing their homework. Junior's up on that top floor doing his homework. They're doing his school like live Zoom, but for some reason, it's very, very, very strangely quiet i'm appreciating this that's why i'm whispering mom ah ela nasce nasce tipo so leon i love you mom how are you sis yeah good i just finished um just a couple of clients that I did today. Oh, sis, I miss you, man. Are the cafes open and everything? We're doing fine. Cafes are open to, um, as of today. Ah. They're allowing. Uh, Trust people. me to think of coffee. <laughs> what and about restaurants? Are restaurants are open. open. Deb, you look really nice on Cami. I've got no makeup on or anything. Yeah, and that just goes to prove how awesome you look. All right, listen, love you all lots, all right? And then text yes. me, text me. Bye guys. Bye. A 
just want to take this moment of peace and tranquility and cleanliness. Mm. Yes, I'm proud and I know it's a bit cringe when I go on about it. God bless Emily. Clean, clean. I just want to reiterate the cleanliness. No. Right, have I made my point? I don't know what to do with myself. Are you in the same place? Yeah. Can I come in? Yeah, I think I can see you. Should I get out? No, this lesson was meant to finish actually a minute ago. She's doing great at school and I'm really proud of this because being a person that, you know, I've really pushed, pushed her, their education and I feel that they've thought I'm a bit mean and a bit pushy, like you've got to study, you've got to study. I've said to them both, I don't care if you don't get good marks, what I care is you get great effort. That is really, really important. Love you. Love you too. No, 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 no. Okay. Dad, what no, are you just, doing? I'm just giving you a kiss. Go man. away. Right. Shut the door. I've been getting her extra math support and extra support that she needs. Um, and actually, she's done incredible. Um, and she actually thinks that it's really helped her, which has made me happy. We're getting great emails from the school saying that she's really, you know, trying and she's really attends everything online and she never misses anything and never makes excuses. Okay, I'm running because I need to get fit. Okay, because I'm just not fit at the moment. You know, because during quarantine, I've been eating a lot of chocolate and sweets. I'm here just doing nothing. She's got a little bit of a problem with the TikTok situation in the sense that it should be called the TikTok tick because she's got a tick, man. Like she walks around, like I've said before, and she just does these weird things, no music. making a lip balm and that's coconut oil okay, and I'm gonna mix it this already looks quite like lip balmy <laughs> so I'm just gonna add more I think that's a lot <laughs> Are tough times coming up probably have I been through tough times before yes have I been through the tough times I'm about to go through before no uh, is it stressing me out no, yes, I don't know. But what I will say is she is an incredible girl and the bond that we have with her as a family is awesome. And she really brings this house to life. Okay guys, this is gonna go wrong, I can tell. Actually, oh. <laughs> I've literally just put oil. Don't put oil on there. Oh. I'm gonna try and convince my dad to do this video. And I'm gonna go and ask him to repeat after me. Why don't I trust you? I don't know, but you should trust me because I'm your daughter. Why have you got that in your hand? You said to act like a microphone. No, I'm, I'm, no. I'm gonna like, yeah. A. B. No, you meant to copy me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. A. A. B. B. C. C. We gotta wait till this gets you. Right. D. D. E. E. A. 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 E. E. <laughs> Again. Oh, I'm so sorry. How does it feel to be you? And just as a little top up. No, I don't want another top up. Thank you kindly. Best! Best! Yes. Oh, really? Do you want me to keep going? <laughs> right, I've managed to keep it clean so far. Oof. We'll see. We'll see. Let's go upstairs. The junior's room. This. I mean, he's got to tidy this up. 
Junior, what's up? What are you saying? Hey, what's all this? Ah, that's oh. our little love cupboard, isn't it? What's this? Hey? Oh, I love them. Yeah, of course you love them. We got a runner, and he's gone again, and he's running again. He's so edible, isn't he? Alright, that's it. Alright, that's it. Get the runners. That's it. Alright, that's it. There you go. There you go. You guys, don't hurt her. Oh man. Guys. Right. No hurting, no hurting. Of course, her relationship with Junior is important and very, very uh, tight bond between the two of them because they've always been together from day one. No. Got, hey, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Take it easy, bro. Take it easy. What time's your next lesson? Do they fight like cats and dogs? Yeah, of course. But I also uh, understand that that is sibling rivalry. That's what happens. So they love each other, but they always argue. Why does Junior have to call me? He can't come downstairs like any other normal person. Yes, that's son. Love you. I'm in the middle of a lesson. Say love you back. <laughs> Love you. Love you too. Bye. Bye. Aww. I can't help it. I think she's going to be a good teenager, right? I've got to think positive. She's going to be an amazing teenager. She's going to be positive. She's still going to want to become a nun. Like, these are standard things. I think she's doing great, honestly, and I'm not that stressed about it. I'm not. I'm not. There's just moments where I think, oh my gosh, because it happens so fast. I mean, how would, how is Junior 15 next, next week? What's all that about? 15? It's like, are you kidding me? Right, come on then. Theo, outside. Let's go. Here, Theo. Right, do you want to sit in the sun? I think you should sit out of the sun, son. <laughs> Whoa. What is wrong with you? Ha oh, ha ha, look at that. I made the kids what they wanted. I'm gonna come and sit outside with them and then I'm gonna make dinner for me and Emily. And I am going to be making us a little Thai green curry. Can I just say that everything has remained clean? That's what I'm talking about. The paste in. Oh yeah. I'm proud of the NHS, I'm proud of Emily, but I have to say it's a bittersweet situation. I worry, she's my wife. She's exposed to the virus. When she comes home, she needs to sort of disinfect herself before we can even see her. So the kids will be in the house and she'll let me know she's coming in. I have to take the kids to another room so they don't know mum's home. Ah, she's home. All right, Theo, no, 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 no. Yeah, no, he can't go near you. I did try and keep him outside. Am I allowed to? Hi, gorgeous. Right, Theo. Oh, I'm sorry. Right, Theo, quick, come outside quickly. You know, oh, you can't go no, to mummy first. Okay. Come over here first. Let's go out there and then mummy will be down in two minutes. Sorry, I tried to have him out by the time he came out. Okay. Emily's doing a naked run and she will not let me film it. So go, 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 go. Oh my God, that looks so good. <laughs> My mouth's actually watering. I just dribbled a bit when I spoke. Mm -hmm. Hey, darling, you all right? Oh my God, Pete, please, can I start? Yeah, I'm good, thank yeah, you. Yeah, I'm gonna sit with you. Is it good? Mm. Lockdown, for some people, it's like the worst case scenario for couples. And for some people, it's the best case scenario. For us, because we came together as a team, it's brought us so much closer. That was so nice, thank you. No, you're so welcome, my love. And it's quite late now, just put these kids to bed. Yeah, let's do it. We pulled together. This was a time that I reckon if you survive situations like this as a couple, you can get through a lot. When we crack the bag? Yeah, crack my bag, okay. What? What are you doing? Well, you told me that I'd no, I get comfortable, bro. Yeah, too comfortable. Just put your arms on my... Let me go. Now, what are you I'm doing? I'm falling asleep on your shoulder. There's videos of this on, on oh, YouTube. Right. You know that? Oh! Ooh. Oh! There's nothing. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh. 
Help me help you. Help me help you. Girl, what you trying to do? What is that? That's actually called a song. I don't know what it's called. Really? Don't know what it's called. Do you want me to back out some videos of you, yeah? No, I really don't yeah. think you should back out. Oh some really? Videos. Okay. No, okay, leave me alone, mate. I'm over it. I mean I, I grew up listening to Motown, pure Motown, you know, so um <coughs> I mean, smoke. Go away. Can you go away?